girl, I don't buy drinks at the bar City girl, get it right with me, I'm a star Get it girl, keep on going, you gon' make it far Get it girl, get it, get it girl Hey YouTube, it's your girl Tiana here So today's video is something different Um, Which I feel like I say that for every intro Today's video is going to be a try-on haul. So before I tell you what kind of try-on haul we're doing, let me give you a little bit of a, a backstory. So today is June 10th, 2020. Um, and as you guys know, we've been dealing with this quarantine coronavirus mess since about early March. Um, and my birthday is April 3rd. So in February, um, me and my friends, we were planning my birthday trip. It was basically all planned. And I was just, you know, in the process of purchasing bathing suits, clothing, um, shoes, whatever I needed <clears throat> to complete all my, my birthday looks. <clears throat> well, of course, um, you know, my whole birthday trip was canceled because of coronavirus. And my, and my birthday was like right when it was at its, its, its peak, its highest. Um, so I had bought seven new bathing suits from this website called Shein.com. Shein, Shein, Shein. I say Shein. I know some people just say Shein. Um, but yes, from Shein. So I've ordered clothes from them before in the past, but I've never ordered bathing suits from them before ever. I never got to wear them because we were supposed to be going to Miami for my birthday, but obviously that never happened. I never got to wear them. But now it's summer. The world is starting to reopen up a little bit. Um, the pool at the property I, I live at is reopened. And I mean, the weather today and yesterday has been like really rainy, really bad. Tomorrow and the rest of the week is gonna be super sunny. So I wanna go enjoy some pool time. So I have seven bathing suits laid out on my bed behind me that I'm going to be doing a little try on haul for you guys today. This is kind of like a check in to see like, well, which bathing suit is my quarantine body gonna um, put on? For the pool tomorrow. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you can be a part of the family. If you are joining us again, welcome back. I so appreciate you keep coming back and watching all the different videos. I appreciate you so much. So let's just get right into it. Okay, so like I said, all of these bathing suits come from um, Shein.com, Shein, however you want to pronounce it. Like I said, I say Shein. Um, and I'm just going to try them on for you. So I've tried them on before, of course, when I was still planning on going to Miami, but um, I feel like I might as well just do another, I'd like a try on video for you. They're all in a size medium, all of them. Normally for me, I like to get bottoms and tops that I can tie. So this one, um, you couldn't, but it was super cute because it came with like a, a headband. But most of these are gonna be bathing suits that can be tied, tightened, or fixed on the side, just because like buying bathing suits online, I feel like I need it to at least be able to be tightened. And especially this website, you cannot return bathing suits. Like their bathing suits are final purchase. So I only have, I think, two that have no type of tie or adjuster or anything at all. So this is the first one. It's like a teal and um, orange um, snake skin. Is it snake skin pattern? So these are the bottoms. This is the one shoulder top and it comes with a headband. So let's go ahead and put that on for you. Okay, so here's the first one. Hopefully you guys can see. Okay, I'm literally on my tippy toes. Um, it's actually really, it still fits and it's really cute. So this is a headband on the model on the store in on the website. She had it as a choker, but like, I promise you this is not meant to be a choker. Like look at how big this is. So this is the first one. And when this first came in and I tried it on, um, I had to dr wash and dry it to try to shrink it. Like bathing suits, I usually just wash and I'll hang dry. Um, but this one, I washed and dried it to try to shrink it because the bottoms were like, they weren't big, but they weren't snug. So this one, now it feels perfect. Like, I don't know if it's the quarantine body or what. Um, the eating too many snacks, not working out as usual. But this is the first one, super cute, fits well. I would definitely wear this as a headband. That's what drew this bathing suit to me the most was that it had a, like a matching piece. But like I said, I would wear it as a headband, not a choker, because this is way too uh, wide to be a, a choker. But I like it. I really like it. And I really like the one shoulder for the bathing suit top. All right, so this is the next one. It's kind of giving you patriotic 4th of July vibes. Um, this one I really like because I really like the top. I like the off the shoulder. Um, I like the high waisted bottoms. This one, when it came in, same thing. I washed and dried it just because I felt like the top needed to shrink a little bit. Like this is a little bit saggy for me. Like I would want it here. Um, this top, 
not here. I would want it here. So this one washed and dried and it, it didn't really work like I wanted it to. So I was planning to take it to a tailor, but um, never got around to it. Then quarantine coronavirus happened. So this is it. I still like it though. I think it's, I mean, it's fine. It wouldn't be like, I don't know. In order for me to really be confident in it and really like how it looks, I would need to get it tailored so it can be up here instead of down here. But not bad. I really like, I don't, don't, I never didn't really care for the colors when I first bought it, but this was the only color that they had for this style. Um, so I figured it was, you know, it's not gonna, it's not the end of the world, but here's the second one. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, I really, was thinking that all these bathing suits were gonna be too small because they like just fit when they first came in the mail. And you know, like I said, quarantine hit us real hard. So the quarantine snacks were definitely heavy in this household. Um, but everything is like good. Like I'm liking it so far. So this was the very first one I picked out when I was looking on Shein for bathing suits. I'm not really sure what's going on here, but I love, love, love the color of this, like that cognac burnt orange type of color. And then I love the back on the top. So it um, laces here so I can adjust it if I need it to. And then it, all, it crisscrosses and it also ties. So I really, really like that. It's adjustable, which is like my favorite. And this one is definitely a hit. I like it. I mean, I don't have any complaints, anything bad to say about it. Um, my bottoms, I usually prefer like they're fitted like this where I can pull the sides up a little bit or um, they would just tie on the side. But this one is cool. I don't mind this one. I like it a lot. Now this one is super basic, but um, like at the same time, super cute. So the top and the bottom have ties that go the full length at the top and bottom. Um, High-waisted top. Um, it's really simple, but it's like a cute bathing suit. The, the ties really add to the style of the bathing suit. This is like a typical Tiana bathing suit. Um, High-waisted bottoms. And I don't normally do strapless tops just because I feel like I need some support to hold the girls up. But this one, because it has the ties on the side, I can tighten it there to make sure it doesn't fall. So I really like this one. Like I said, basic, but like super cute. This is the kind of bathing suit that you could pair a really cute sandal with or a really cute hat, some shades. Um, because it is so basically cute. On to the next. Before we get to the next bathing suit, just a little um, heads up warning. These next three are totally like out of what I would normally wear for a bathing suit. Um, but like I said, the idea or the plan was we were going to Miami for my birthday. Oh, so it's like go bigger or go home. This next one is not too, too bad, but the two following are where it gets a little bit like Tiana Wood in the world, what are you doing? This is the next one. Um, I really like this and that's shocking for me because like, as you can tell from the first three bathing suits, um, I like bottoms that like cover and this one does not cover much. The top has like no type of support to it. The style is super cute though. Like I like this top, I like the bottoms. Um, I don't know if I would probably wear, I would probably wear some bigger bottoms just cause I'm not too like much loving these bottoms. The idea of this bathing suit is um, really cute. I really like the top. I would just, you know, it's like I have it pulled super tight um, and the bottoms are cute also. I don't know if I need to loosen the strings on the side, but. So this one, surprisingly my quarantine body, my extra snack um, in the house, board in the house and in the house board, eating all the snacks body prefers this bathing suit a lot more than my birthday body did and would have at the time. So I like, my favorite part about this is the top. Um, I like, it's how it's more of like a sports bra look to it, but it's still dainty with the ties on the side. I like the black and white feather design. And then the bottoms I was very weary of, mainly because I don't really have much going on back there. But um, I figure, you know, she and they sell their bathing suits as a set. Um, you can look separately. They have, you know, you can separate it between just tops, just bottoms or sets. But it, it, when I did that, I wasn't finding just this top. Oh no, I don't have a booty. I know I don't have a booty, but like, in the bathing suit, we got a little something going on. I like this set, and like I said, I think my quarantine extra snack body likes this bathing suit more than my birthday body would have. I'm happy now because, like, 
I'm thinking if I was in Miami with this bathing suit on, I wouldn't have been too happy with it, but I'm extra happy with it right now. This is definitely a plus. We like this. We like the feather thong bottom bathing suit. I like her. All right, so this was also a cover-up that I purchased, um, also from Shein. Um, just a basic black, like, you know, neck cover-up um, that would look really good in pictures. And it's, of course, not too thick because it's, you know, net has holes in it. But I wanted to put it on. This is the last bathing suit, so I wanted to put it on with this bathing suit because this is the most risky bathing suit. Before, and I'm not going to take off the cover-up so you, um, I mean, just try your best to get a feel for the bathing suit through the cover-up. Before we as a collective society canceled Doja Cat. When I bought this bathing suit, I was running around the house singing her song on the cow. But now, I mean, I still like it. It's definitely not what I would wear. It's just a basic triangle top with cow print and then a really small cow print bottom as well. There's not much to the back um, at all. Not much to the bathing suit at all, period. But I promise you, underneath this cover-up, it is super cute. Like, this right here is a look. Like, this is like if we were in Miami. Um, if we were in Miami, and my friend Khalees kept telling me, Tiana, you better not bring that cow bathing suit with you. But I was going to, of course, anyway. Um, if, we, if I were to wear this in Miami, I would probably wear this like this. This would be something that I feel like I would wear, um, like, at a beach bar. Because um, this cover-up, really compliments the bathing suit really well and it really goes like i like how this looks together it's like the cow print is a little bit odd it's definitely different but it just like the other bathing suit um the red white and blue one this was the only color they had for the only pattern or color that they had for this style bathing suit so i like it it's it's different though so this is cover up and bathing suit together Okay, you guys, so that's really all I have for this Shein bathing suit try-on haul video slash um, seeing which bathing suits fit my quarantine body video. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to the channel if you have not already become a part of the family and leave some comments down below. Let me know if you've ever bought anything from Shein before, how you liked it, how you didn't like it. Um, suggest any other websites if you have some that maybe sell really great bathing suits. And yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. I'll see you in my next video.